Wouldn't it be revolutionary if doctors could really sniff out cancer, giving an instant diagnosis of where the disease is and how far it is advanced? Dogs can detect cancer from urine and breath samples. The ancient Greeks diagnosed a wide variety of diseases through exhaled breath. This is the passion and genius of Technion professor Hossam Haik, who was moved by witnessing firsthand the suffering of a friend with leukemia. My uh, best friend was diagnosed with cancer, and I have seen his suffer, and it was really painful. This was my first time to think about the concept of cancer. The person exhales into the device for a couple of minutes, and the device will analyze the breath with an array of nanosensors. The patented device is designed to indicate where the cancer is affecting the body and the stage of the disease. Even in the very early stages of the disease, the device can give an indication of future risk. First, I thought to myself, this is science fiction, can't be true. However, the initial results were promising, and of course more research needs to be done, but if this study will be extended and more patients participate, and then the figures will repeat themselves, then we have really something new that could be a very important tool in the early detection of cancer and also in the follow-up of uh, malignant disorders through therapy. The device would be available in the clinics within three years. We will start with the breast and colorectal cancer, but for the other types of cancer or disease, I would expect it will take another seven years from now. Technion has a powerful name for opening multidisciplinary fields to allow such life-saving innovations. Technion is a place where the commitment to serve humanity goes beyond religious and cultural borders. Professor Hike grew up in Nazareth. If the Middle East was similar to the Technion, we would live in peace. Technion, beyond culture, beyond borders, serving the health of humanity.